Welcome to Beyond Soup, where I put up all sorts of stuff. Today we have another vintage item. This is the Heathkit GC1094 electronic alarm clock. This was built in 1975, and it has a amber color display. Uh, it's about seven inches wide, four and a half inches deep, and two and three quarter inches tall. Just wanted to show you how this unit is functioning, so let's go ahead and plug it in. When you plug it in, it shows you that display. And on the bottom are your adjustments. Um, this is for hour, minutes, your alarm adjustment, your time adjustment. And then if you want to turn on your alarm, uh, it's actually down. And then this is like your snooze switch. Let's go ahead and just simply turn it on. You put it um, to the right for the time. And if you push it back to your left, it starts your counting. When you want to make your adjustments, yeah, you put it to the right like that. And then your minute, uh, your hour, let's put it to six o'clock. And then for the minutes, do the same thing. Hold it, it'll count to nine and it'll start again. And then if you want to make changes to that digit, you have to hit both um, the hour and the minute at the same time. So, whoop. okay, so 6.35 is the time right now. And then when you put it back, then it starts that countdown. Same thing with the alarm. You switch it to um, the right. And let's make the same adjustment. Let's make it the alarm at 6. Maybe if we could switch it to 6.36. Oops. And, and and then put it back. So it should go off. Oh, let's turn this on. Should go off. Six thirty. There it is. Okay. That's what it sounds like when it, the alarm is on. And then if you hit the snooze, you can stop it or simply put the switch back. That is, uh, that's it. That's how uh, this thing looks like. And you can see that it is in pretty good shape for 1975. Um, does have some light marks or uh, hairline marks uh, possible like nicks here here and there but otherwise it's working um, again this is the Heath kit GC 1094 alarm clock I hope you uh, like that video uh, that's pretty much it for this item um, and if you did like that video, please give it a thumbs up uh, and possibly join the channel. That's Beyond Soup, where I put up all sorts of stuff. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys on the next video.